Hi everyone! So today I'm going to talk to you guys about my new find, these Badger uh, lip tints. So I recently realized since I got this at my local Sprouts that I'm not really a lipstick person and I guess it took finding the lip tint um, to figure that out. So I got my first one um, in the shade Garnet and I loved it so much I went and I bought the other two that were available which are the Red Jasper and the Rose Tourlamine. So I haven't tried these but I'm going to show you guys how awesome this one is. So I have nothing on my lips. I'm just going to... This is like the perfect thing to keep in your purse and just put on to give your face a little bit of life without looking like um, your lips look fake. <laughs> Sorry about my baby. Um, like your lips look, um, you know, like have that lipstick that doesn't look natural anymore so um it's a good amount of color so this is the garnet like i said and by the way these are organic all natural um ingredients they're made with oils they're not vegan because they do have beeswax but of course they are cruelty free so these are made with beeswax castor seed oil sunflower oil olive fruit oil coconut oil cocoa seed butter shea butter um, the mica and the iron oxides are the minerals that um, make the color um, carnauba wax aloe leaf extract sunflower vitamin e rosehip fruit extract i lost my place um, there we go. Um, sea buckhorn fruit extract, rose flower oil, vanilla fruit extract, and that's it. So those are the ingredients for the garnet shade that I'm wearing right now. So I'm going to take this off and try on the red jasper. Okay, so I took it off and of course my lips have more color because I've just rubbed off the shade and they've gotten color from the cloth I used. So I'm trying to work this around my baby, coming to take my mineral lip tints, I'm trying to sneak them out of here. Okay. So oops. This is the red jasper. So I haven't personally um, really noticed a difference, at least on camera. I don't have a mirror in front of me, but mm, I'm not sure. I guess it might be more red. I don't know if it'll be obvious on the screen, but I'll have to um, observe these. Um, an outdoor like when I'm outside in a mirror not in front of my cell phone screen all right so red jasper again and then I'm gonna take this off and try my last one which is rose tourlamine and it comes in the cap with the lightest color so I'm taking off the sticker and I will take this off and re be right back so you guys can see how it looks Okay, nothing on my lips once again, and I'm going to apply the rose for the main. So pretty obvious this one is the least... Um, pigmented one 
This is the most natural looking one. Um, I like all of them. They all look pretty natural to me, especially if I want it to look even more natural. I think I'll just apply less because I pressed on my lips pretty hard with these. I love them all. I love the ingredients. I love the price. They're like $2.99 each. And I just love the look. So I wanted to um, do a review and I recommend these for anybody that just needs a little pop of color and is not a fan of lipstick. Just, I don't know. I think lipstick looks too overdone. I don't know. It's not for me. It's not my style. I do like the color of my cacti um, shade, my lip butter lip uh, lipstick by 100% pure, but it's something I would wear like, um, I know I wanted it like as an everyday color, but I think I'll end up wearing it like for a special occasion and keep these mineral tints as my everyday color because that's what feels better for me, my style personally. So anybody with similar style will really like these Badger lip mineral lip tints. So hope this helps somebody um, decide um, if they want to get them or not. I noticed there weren't any reviews on them. So I'm the first, hopefully, that did the review on them. Thanks for watching, guys, and see you next time. <laughs> Bye.